This is Ryan. Uh, this will be Sophia. Hi, it's Nolan. Hello, it's Kate, and uh, it's also Kendra. You know, yeah, yeah. Now we're going to show you how to do a cluster map. <laughs> to start off with, you go right up to the top and put it in the clusters map website. If you don't type in the right address, you should be um, redirected to the home page. So that is the Clusters Maps website. Now go back to your blog. Copy and paste the address of your blog. So that's like Ryan's blog 17 blogspot. So it'd be something like that. And paste it into the URL. like so. Put, then in, put in your email. Your school email address, you should have one. And click on make my map. So once that has happened, you'll get um, an HTML code. And so you go back to your A portfolio and um, press customize. Press add a gadget and go down to HTML code slash um, JavaScript. So um, go back and copy and paste the HTML code from the cluster map into the, your um, little window that you opened before. You can make a title if you really want to. But the title doesn't really matter. <laughs> Cluster maps or something like that would Go do. and press save and it will be start to save thing. So if you're still on the cluster maps, you can cross out of that now and you'll see that cluster maps is there. You can change where it is just by dragging and dropping it. So press view blog and then you'll find, Voila. yeah, you'll find your cluster maps right there and you can click on it and it's enlarged. That's pretty cool. Wow. Amazing. And there you have it, your own cluster map. Once it's loaded, yes. which should be soon. But don't click on it. <laughs> oh, <we> Woohoo! <laughs> Finally, we did it!